There are new concerns tonight that electric customers in Cleveland and across the Midwest could be hit with a rate hike. An exclusive five on your side investigation first revealed how rate payers are being billed for electricity they never received. Tonight, there are new developments. On your side, Chief Investigator Ron Regan joins us with news of a federal probe into the plant. Well, Chris, we're talking about a brand new power plant serving Cleveland and dozens of cities across the Midwest. Now, on the heels of our investigation, federal regulators are seizing records and asking questions. We're getting a good hose in. That was Cleveland Councilman Mike Polenzik last summer, and this is what he and communities across the Midwest are paying for. It's a brand new $5 billion power plant in southern Illinois. A plant we found was failing to generate electricity for four full months. Meanwhile, dozens of communities were stuck paying off bonds that built it. At least $3.7 million and no power. Now, the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission is investigating. Inside this annual report, Peabody Energy reveals the SEC is seizing records related to the plant's development. Environmental groups are watching it closely. They've apparently subpoenaed Peabody in relation to the development of the Prairie State plant and clearly are investigating problems there which have been brought to their attention. Neither the SEC nor Peabody, of course, reveals much more beyond that, but we all know the SEC does not do this kind of thing lightly. They only move in when they believe there's a serious problem to be investigated. Our initial investigation prompted congressional calls for a federal probe. The story that you did that showed the way municipalities are being uh, hit with costs for this, and at the time they were being hit with costs even before it generated uh, one electron, <laughs> uh, was felt all across the uh, Midwest. Since our report first aired, problems related to startup at the plant have been resolved, and it's generating electricity. But we found Cleveland Council has never been told of the pending SEC investigation. Was not aware of it at all. Councilman Polenzik says the director of Cleveland Public Power, who advised buying into the plant, never briefed city council. We have not been briefed since our last discussion. We need to get a briefing from the director of public utilities and the commissioner of Cleveland Public Power. Obviously, we have a financial stake in that facility. Uh, and we're, we can take a major hit. Meanwhile, Polenzik fears the ongoing probe of Prairie State could hit ratepayers. It is an enterprise account. Uh, it's not supported by the general fund of the city. So if there are additional costs, they're borne by the, by the ratepayers, people like myself that have to pay a monthly bill. And the Securities and Exchange Commission declined to comment. The director of Cleveland Public Power says he's monitoring developments. And Peabody Energy tells me it's cooperating with federal investigators. We'll follow what happens next to your light bill. I'm Chief Investigator Ron Regan.